Hello, my name is Manfred and welcome to my kitchen. Today, we're going to make a very, very delicious sandwich. It's a version of the famous Reuben sandwich. We're going to do the blue Reuben sandwich. That has the butter, the rye bread, the Swiss cheese, the corned beef, the sauerkraut, and the blue cheese dressing. Now you can learn how to do the blue cheese dressing on manfreedinthekitchen.com. Very fast, takes five minutes, very, very easy to do. All right, the first thing we always do in the kitchen, we wash the hands because you're out there in the public, you're wandering around, you don't know who touched what and everything, so you gotta make sure the hands are clean and also make sure that the fingernails are clean also. Now, this is very, very quick. You got the friends, you got the relatives, maybe the family come home and they say, hey, Manfred, what are we gonna have? And Manfred, uh, you know, he say, tonight we're going to have a really delicious flavor. We're going to have the blue Reuben. Now, this is very quick. First thing you need, two pair, one pair. Two pair would be four, one pair is two, you know, of the, of, uh, the uh, rye bread. Set that down like that. Now. You take the first thing, oh, we're going to take the uh, corned beef and just place it on one side and you take the corned beef, you place it on the other side. Don't bother to fold it under. It looks very nice with the meat hanging out on the side, yeah. The next thing, the Swiss cheese. That is the cheese with the holes in it. Can you see? Oh yeah. You can buy these. Now look, Manfred have two slice and two slice. You can buy two slice at the market or the grocery store. You don't have to buy a lot if you don't want. You can say, hey, I'm gonna make the one sandwich. So there we are, one on each piece. Now back here, Manfred get the fork because we have the sauerkraut. The sauerkraut has been squeezed and all the juice is taken out. And you just take and put the sauerkraut, oh, just like that, right on the sandwich. Oh, that's excellent. Yeah, just spread that out. Oh, this is going to be delicious. Now, oh, we got the heat on. We should get the fry pan down and preheat the fry pan. Now put the handle in here. You put the handle out here, the little kid come along and grab it, spray all over. Oh, no, you know you got the mess. Or maybe you'll be dancing or doing something. Hey. You want to make sure the handle is inside here. We let that heat just a touch. Now, oh, now we have the piece of resistance right now. Back here, we have pre-made the blue, the blue, the blue, <laughs> oh, that's wrong. The blue cheese dressing. Now you notice that it is labeled, it's in the fridge and it have the date on it. This is day one for this, okay? So you just take the top off. You can find out how to make... Oh, Manfred, he have to stop talking sometime because the, the aromas in the kitchen are so beautiful. The blue cheese is just lovely. So let's get, the, let's get another fork back here. We're going to take the blue cheese out. It's pre... Oh, yeah, and just... Oh, this is going to be delicious. That's it. Oh... You, you know, you put on this as uh, what you want. Manfred, he's very liberal. He know he got the friends coming in. Well, actually, you know, uh, it's going to be uh, the camera girl and the tech guy and me. We're going to share this because we've been looking forward to the flip. Oh, look at that. Look how much he got on there. Okay, that's good. Wipe this off. Put that in the sink. That'd make a little noise, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, wow. Put the top back on. These are called the leftovers. We can make another sandwich tomorrow, or the blue cheese is also very dressing, very, very good for the salad also. So we maybe have the salad later. Put this back in the fridge. There we are. Now you got to make the choice. Which one you're going to put on which side? Oh, we got a little fall off here. We'll put that in. Set that on the top like that. Press that down. Oh, this is going to be delicious. Ba oh, back here. That's getting warm. I'm just going to set that off for a second because it's very warm. Get the knife. Now, many of the uh, cookbook that you have say, you put the bread in here first and then you start to build it. You build that in there, you go, oh, you're gonna, you got the chance to hurt. So Manfred, show you. Put the butter on all the way to the edges, on the top like this, oh yeah. That's it. Set this back on the heat. Manfred going to get just a bit of the uh, cooking oil 
very thin layer. You don't need to put very much in. No, no, no. Once that's heated, that's it. You kids can do this. If you got the big fry pan, you kids, and you beginner cook, just do this. Make the small layer. Take the sandwich. Place it down like that. Over here. Oh, we got some on the finger. We put it there. That's what this is for. Now, notice how much easier it is just to put the butter on when the, like that when it's very, very easy. Oh, that's good. That's good. We can put this in the uh, sink. Oh, this is a little messy. We'll have to set this over here. And we'll just set the plate back here for now, just like that. Does that look good? That looks all right there, tech guy? Yeah, hey, that's good. Back here, we got the spatula. Because we got the non-stick fry pan, we got the uh, flexible. Now, Manfred have this on high right now. Whoops, <laughs> that didn't work so good, did it? because he wants to get this done to show you. Oh, look at that. Now you may have the heat lower down to make sure that it heat through a little more, but Manfred have it like this just for the demonstration. This is not gonna take very long. Can see you see how beautifully toasted that is? That is lovely. Oh, that looks like about long enough. Take that off, set it there. This can go in the fridge, we take this off. Make sure you turn the heat off. Oh, we got a little, let's just back here. You keep a many of the cloth around in, the, in the, the kitchen. We set that over. That butter is still good. We can put this in the fridge for later. Oh, we got a little cabbage here too, or uh, coleslaw. Back here, we got the knife. Get the one with the, with the shark's teeth because that's the uh, knife that makes the, uh, that cuts the bread. It's called the bread knife, you know. Cut that down like this. Oh boy, this smell, the blue cheese, that just smells so delicious. Yes, wipe the hands off. Let's put a little bit of the, we got the clean fingers, so we put a little bit of the coleslaw right there. Hey, that's it. There is the perfect blue Reuben, the Reuben sandwich made with the blue cheese dressing. It's healthy, it's homemade, it's simple. Oh, and it's so quick to make. Uh, the friends, the relatives will like it. You can learn more on manfreedinthekitchen.com. I said enough, hey, I am no chef, but I can cook. And Manfred looked forward to eating this.